You're watching the Rotoscopers YouTube. My name is Chelsea Robson, and today I'm going to be reviewing the trailer for Mr. Peabody and Sherman. I've always seen little snippets of this cartoon, but it was never something that I got into, so I'm not really familiar with all of the background plots, all of the characters, so I'm really being introduced to this franchise just like so many people. I feel like I'm going to like this movie. Now, on occasion, there have been a lot of these time travel movies that have gotten out of hand because they don't know how to do time travel correctly. This one, for whatever reason, has a taste of Bill and Ted's Excellent Adventure, which, ironically enough, was one of the few movies that I thought did do time travel correctly. <laughs> so hopefully it's going to be done right. Most of the spots on this movie are focusing on the amazing Mr. Peabody and his fantastic array of talents. I mean, he's a professional musician in all genres and types, as well as an inventor, super smart, knows everything, and he's a licensed chiropractor. I need one of those. But most of this is actually focusing on him and how he's trying to be a regular father. Honestly, I don't know how this little dynamic is gonna work out. Like I said, I never saw any of the old cartoons, so I don't know, but I mean, it's just really hard for me to see a dog, no matter how amazing, as the father figure. So, I'm a little leery. One of the other real key questions that I had as I'm watching all of these trailers is, what's the deal with the Petersons? Why are they so important? And why is it that Mr. Peabody is going to such lengths to make them like him? He also wants Sherman to really impress Penny here. So, there's gotta be something. I mean, does he need money? But then, I mean, he's a professional musician and inventor and amazing. He's even got a Wayback Machine. There's no other, I can't even say dog, other entity that is more amazing than Mr. Peabody. So what's the deal? Who are the Petersons and what do they hold? This is the question. There's a cute bit of mischief in all of this as well as some puppy love that just kind of makes you, it's endearing. And of course, Patrick Warburton, Kronk, Putty. I love this man so much. Every time I've ever gone to California Adventure, I always go to Soaring Over California, and it always makes me so happy to see him as the flight conductor. Ah, Putty, Kronk, you're amazing. I know that he's typecasted, but yay. <laughs> We've got Danny Elfman on score and He's just fantastic, so that should be good. And as the trailer points out, it was directed by Rob Minkoff, who is best known in the world of animation for Lion King and Stuart Little. I'm excited about this one. It looks really fun and it has a lot of elements that I think I'm gonna enjoy. But the real question is, are you gonna go see it when it comes into theaters on March 7th? Let us know in the comments below. Also, let us know any other trailers that you would like us to cover. And tell us what are you looking forward to seeing. Until next time, my name is Chelsea Robson and you are watching the Rotoscopers YouTube.